Good morning! Uh, I just want to preface this video by saying I know this is a very bad idea, but I'm going to do it anyways. So what I'm doing today is I had the idea to go on Tinder and ask people for coffee. Not, not to take me to get coffee, just to send me Starbucks gift cards or money to get coffee. Because I have no money because my entire channel got demonetized. Thanks, YouTube. Anyways, I am aware this is a bad idea and I'm aware that it's probably somehow illegal, but... I guess we'll find out when the cops come knocking on my door. So, funny enough, I actually have had a Tinder before. Not really to, like, go on dates or anything. Like, I've never been on a Tinder date, but I kind of just went on there for fun, I guess. To, like, see who's on there. Um, so I have one. But I'm just gonna go ahead and change my profile. So right now it says Casey, 19 years old, poli sci major and coffee fanatic. My Venmo is, oh, I already have my Venmo in here. Oh no. See, I was already trying to get money out of people before this video. Okay, let's just change this to say, I need money for coffee, heart, and then I'll leave my Venmo in there. And then I have four pictures of myself that you've probably seen on my Twitter or Instagram. If you haven't seen them, you should follow me at A-Y-Y-E-E, -E, it's Casey. Anyways, I guess what I'm just going to do is start swiping right on every single person. Oh, and I forgot to tell you, I set my age range up pretty high. My age range is at 25 plus, so I don't get any people my age because Lord knows they don't have money for coffee either. So let's just start swiping on everybody. Like, 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 like. I already matched with somebody, so. Like, 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 like. Match with somebody again. Wait, was that? I know I'm gonna have a screen recording up here, but look at this. I just matched with, can we get a little bit of focusing in here, please? Dwight from the office. So that's pretty cool. Like, like, I can't go fast because everyone on here has already liked me somehow. So, um, just give me a few minutes and I'm just going to continue liking every single person on here. And I'll come back in a minute. No one's messaging me, so maybe I'm not being aggressive enough. That should do it. I got my first message. It says, hey, how are you? I'm caffeine deprived. Sent. We'll see where this goes. Okay, maybe I need to take more of an aggressive approach because no one's messaging me. So I'm gonna make the first move. So this guy's bio says, looking for a beer. So I'm gonna message him and say, looking, can't spell. Looking for a beer, question mark, question mark, question mark. 
more like looking for a coffee. Winky face. This is for sure gonna get me coffee. Oh! The other guy responded to me. He said, LOL, there's a cure for that. It ends in bucks, dot, dot, dot. I'm looking for someone to treat my symptoms, dot, 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 winky face. God, I'm so good at flirting. I would be throwing my money at me if I were somebody else. But you know, we all can't handle someone like me. Caffeine deprived, dot, dot, dot. That's easy. What else ails you? Gotta do a quick Google search for ales. One sec. <laughs> Define ails. Trouble or afflict someone in mind or body. Exercise is good for whatever ails you. Oh, so caffeine is ailing me. Who uses that kind of vocabulary? Whatever. If it gets me coffee, that's fine. That's pretty much it. Dot, dot, dot. I'm a simple gal. Who wouldn't want me? Okay, so this guy's bio says Disney pass holder. So I'm gonna say Disney pass holder. Impressive. But what about a Starbucks card holder. Winky face. Scent. Bill enjoys great food, a perfect drink, and a positive outlook and attitude. Good drink? Question mark. What kind of drink? Hopefully you're talking coffee. Winky face. Brad has a list of things that he loves, but I don't see coffee on there, so I'm going to have to ask. You have a very extensive list of things you love, dot dot dot. I noticed that coffee is missing, dot dot dot. Care to explain? We have a new chat. Hi there, how are you? Very caffeine deprived. Dot dot dot. You? Winky face. The other guy, David, replied, Fair. Cream in your coffee? Where are you from? I'm not interested in telling him where I'm from. I'll answer the cream part though. I'm more of a soy milk fan myself. He doesn't need to know where I live to send me money. Xavier said, relax at my house, just listening to music here. What you up? What? Just trying to get some coffee, dot dot dot. Do you like coffee? Jared also has a pretty extensive list of things that he's into, which uh, features cheese and hip hop, but where's the coffee, Jared? Let's ask. I noticed you have a fairly extensive list of things you're into, dot, dot, dot. I also noticed it is lacking the beautiful brown 
drink of coffee. Do you not love the taste of heaven in your mouth? David said, it's so good though, and I don't count calories. I'm guessing you like older men? I'm gonna answer the first part and say, why don't you count your money that you spend on coffee for me? Winky face. <laughs> yes, I do. Strong, medium, light, and sweet. What's your taste? I prefer strong. Dot, dot, dot. Just like my men. Jared says, I enjoy coffee almost as much as cheese, but cheese has never made me need to poop at inopportune times. Coffee has many times, usually in rush hour traffic. <laughs> oh, Jared. Very, very true. Dot, dot, dot. But normally worth it. Great choice. You married? This isn't going anywhere. I'm married to the coffee. Um, I found a sugar daddy on here. Should I, uh, take this opportunity to ask for money for coffee? I think yes. Hello, Ralph. I am a young girl in dire need of coffee. Dot, dot, dot. Think you can help me out? Jared said, eh, maybe, but pretty sure cheese is still somehow better. Laughing face. That being said, I have to ask why you can't find the $2 to buy your coffee and feel like you need folks to send you the money. Just wondering, because I'm thinking about doing the same, but for cheese. I could offer to send a photo... Oh. I could offer to send a photo of my boobs if they send me cheese money. I think he's on to us. It's more romantic to purchase a coffee with money given to me by a hot, strong man. Winky face. Especially one who loves cheese. David said, you seem to be one of my many coffee lovers on Tinder. I guarantee, I guarantee, I love it the most, dot, dot, dot. That being said, dot, dot, dot. What do you think about buying me a coffee question mark winky face I mean maybe but at that point I'd be more likely to say instead of me sending you the money why don't we say that if I ever cross paths with you I will buy you a coffee how am I to know that you're not a Nigerian prince I'm sure the Nigerian prince is in need of a little pick-me-up as well. Dot dot dot. Who are we to deprive? Maybe so, but I'm sure the prince, in all his greatness, 
can afford a cup of Joe. And who's to say that it's not sexy to get a photo of my boobs? Sexy is subjective. I... I never doubted the sexiness of your cleavage photos. But I do believe in all my greatness that I deserve a cup of joe. That's fine, but I'm sure there's less sketchy ways to find your cup of coffee. Well, I tried. And I failed. And I ended up with zero more dollars than when I started. So, the only way I'm going to get a cup of coffee is if YouTube re-monetizes my channel. So, if you liked this video, or if you like me, hit the subscribe button down below. Just smash it! And like this video if you, uh, for some reason enjoyed this. I make new videos every single day, so just subscribe. Subscribe to help this poor girl in need, in need of coffee. Thank you for watching. Um, I will be deleting this app right now, and I will see you next time. Bye!